Welcome to the July-August issue of GBND. I'm Tim Schuler. I'm the managing editor. This is Aaron Lewis. He's the art director. Uh, we're really excited about our back to school issue because a, we were able to bring Rachel Gutter on as the guest editor. She's the executive director of the Center for Green Schools, which is run by the USGBC. Um, and because we present our 2013 education portfolio, which showcases a number of different projects, everything from pre-K to university. Yeah, and Rachel Gutter pops up throughout the issue, adds her kind of two cents to what's going on with various projects or proposals and things like that. Mm -hmm. so. um, one thing that we wanted to do with the issue was show the breadth of what was happening. Um, and while that was great for the content of the issue, it presented a challenge when it came to the cover. <laughs> right. Because everything was very project specific. Um, nothing really spoke to that K through 12, up to community colleges and beyond. And so when it came to coming up with a concept for that, we tried all sorts of things that either were very project specific or then were just a little bit too generic. Yeah. Chalkboard walls, which says white, restaurant, right? Uh, Whiteboards, smart boards, kids in the middle of a forest. <laughs> yeah. uh, and we finally kind of settled on Legos as something that spoke to design and architecture and to education as well. And so we went to the local Lego store and bought this set that was sort of, it was a firehouse actually, and we were going to retrofit it to be a school and add green things like solar panels, wind turbines, a water cistern. Yeah. <clears throat> and then we realized that that had actually kind of been done already. And Not so, quite, but too close for comfort. Too close for comfort. So we went back to the drawing board, still sticking with the Legos because we had bought all these Legos. <laughs> uh, we returned the set and went instead to the bulk bins of Legos and spent a couple hours at the Lego store collecting um, giant things full of Legos, which we then uh, built letters out of. We went back to just the headline, the Building Greener Schools, and as you can see behind me, it's actually pretty big. Uh, it also falls apart a lot. A lot, <laughs> but I mean little pieces, so yeah, that's how we came up with the cover. Yeah, You can see more of Legos um, drawn into the Community College feature. Um, as well, I would point you to the Green Typology section of this issue, which deals with how design, food, and education all interrelate. Yeah. So, thanks for watching.